German car is probably one of the quirkiest ones I've ever seen. It was made when East Germany was still under Soviet control. I'm at Trabant Berlin, which is a company that specializes in renting out Trabants. These guys are experts at Trabants. They have a fully equipped workshop to service and repair them. The chassis of this car is made from metal, but the actual panels are made from cotton. The interior is kind of sparse. I mean, there's an all important ashtray. The gear shifter is column mounted and it's a bit strange. To get gear one, you push back and then down. Gear two, gear three, and gear four. For reverse, you push all the way in and then down. Under the bonnet, things are a bit more strange. The engine is a two-stroke and there's no coolant. Because it's a two-stroke, it uses both oil and petrol at the same time. After you filled up the petrol, you can use this stick to measure how much you put in. The hood, again, because it's made of pressed cotton, is extremely light. Underneath the car looks quite ordinary for the time, except the exhaust silencer is here. To heat the cabin, there is a fan here. Air is blown over the engine and then over the exhaust that's underneath the front and then into the cabin through here. Starting up and riding, the car is kind of noisy, but it's an experience.